So welcome to Money's Designs. Uh, this is part two of Dr. Martin's Hydrus in uh, Mythomorphia. I'm doing the front dragon this time. Um, and I have I have a painter with me. I'm not sure what we're actually going to call him, but uh, <laughs> my daughter my daughter found him down the garden. So uh, so this might be cut short because we've got some little men coming round. So we've got Alfie and one thing and another. But I just thought I'd play a bit. So I've decided I don't think I want to do dark flames. I think I quite like these these very light yellow flames. Actually, I'm better moving the camera. That's better. So I'd really like these. I've got a bit of orange in there. Um, So it's turned into a butterfly cam, I'm afraid, today. <laughs> but he's just flown in the coffee. I thought he'd go in the paints, but he hasn't. But he likes the end of the paint rush because it's near the the warm lime lamp. I have a daylight lamp, and of course, he obviously thinks it's summer. Because it's a bit wintry out there now. So I thought I'd just do this for a little while longer so we can see all the bits that I've missed. Um, I think I'm just going to go... There's just two, one or two little bits that I wanted to do differently. Um... And then what I think I might do then is put some, just a tiny bit of, I think I'm going to put that orange. This is the orange I actually made. Oops. So this is the orange I made with, um, and I think probably that might be the darkest I want to go. <laughs> Still painting with a butterfly on the end of my brush. <laughs> he doesn't seem to want to go anywhere. So, bless him. Um, there's not many places he can actually go because he's, he's not well, bless him. My daughter found him down the garden. So, thanks for stopping by. This is a live show with live peoples and live butterflies. <laughs> live butterflies. But the daylight lamp is just there. So he, of course, he loves it. It's like being outside. Um, yeah, I think I kind of like, I, I was going to go for a really dark carmine, but I think having an orange with that green is going to be quite nice. And it's and it's enough. I don't need a very dark color. Oopsie. Sorry about the chomping, but it's feeding time at the zoo. Who's got any questions? So I didn't reconstitute them. I just put a drop and I made a couple of oranges and a couple of reds because they're a bit pinkier, the reds that come in the number one set of the hydras. So I made it with a couple of drops of yellow and one drop of, I made two reds and then the, the the, the coldest red, almost like a vermilion, I made one drop of that tiny bit and that actually made an, a really nice orange. Oopsie, sorry butterfly. But you've got to understand he's probably enjoying that because it's like 
being on a leaf blowing in in the wind and it was very windy yesterday <laughs> it was very windy yesterday so apologies for the uh, the butterfly come but um, it's like, a bit like having a toddler the minute I let him fly away once he landed in the coffee and of course Alfie thinks anything's fair game if it moves it belongs to Alfie so you've got to be a bit careful and his wings are in a state look how folded up and screwed up they are his front wings are completely screwed up and I hasten to add he's not glued to the end of the paintbrush in case anybody's wondering <laughs> he's not glued He just quite likes to be exactly where he is because it's near the it's near the daylight lamp. It's not very good for seeing things though, so apologies. But I don't suppose he'll be here next week. They only live about a week or two, the butterflies, so So I kind of like this orange red. That's not going to be so bad. That that's going to look quite nice. And I've had two oranges. I've had a gamboge, and I think the orange is going to be the darkest. Um, I think that's going to look quite nice because all those flames are going to be attached to this green, this thalo green. Oh, welcome back, Melody. Thank you for stopping by. So, welcome to Bunny's Designs. It's a live show. <laughs> a live show. It's recorded for Ustream.tv and also for YouTube. <laughs> for people to watch at the leisure. And we have a butterfly come today. This is a rescued little boy. I don't know what we're going to call him. My daughter keeps coming up with names. I was going to call him Orville, actually. I think I'm going to call him Orville. Because after the duck that couldn't fly, he's a butterfly that can't fly. So I think we're going to call him Orville. <laughs> so thanks, guys, for stopping by. It's, as I say, it's a bit... It's up, my shows are always weird, but <laughs> probably slightly more, slightly more stranger than before. So we thought Alfie was cute. This is Orville, who um, has, oh, there's going to be a bark alert, who has curled up wings, and my daughter found him. Do you see how he's bent his wings right back? That means he's basking, I think. I think. So we could have a bark alert. So thanks for stopping by, guys. Um, not sure how noisy it's going to get, because it can get rather crazy around here yeah I think I like those colors actually I think I like those colors I still got to decide what's wave and what what's sea and wave and what's um, that's orange actually I can do that because that's that's the same orange I missed the top of that so we've got clouds in there, we've got waves, we've got spray, we've got all sorts. So um, it's never going to be easy. Oh yes, um, I've got Hansa yellow in that one. which, um, And then I put yellow here. Oopsie, let's see if I can get that across. Um, and I've put, um, I think I put some yellow there. It's in part one. I put some yellow there. And then I put a drop of every colour that I had. 
and then I put um, some drops of yellow and I made a more of a cad red and then I made an orange because I wanted an orange colour and I didn't have an orange but I do go th I did go through them because I didn't mix them together and, and that's the bits that are dry are cracked and there's another drop on top but if you mix all that together with a damp brush it would come Oh, hi, Bob. Welcome to Bunny's Designs. Anybody else that's popping in? It's a live butterfly cam. <laughs> He's doing his dead act now. Why are you doing your dead act now? Now, you see, I can't. I just cannot. There's no way I can get that wing out of there. We poked, didn't we? We poked, I know. We poked him all day yesterday, and we could not straighten those wings out. So that could be a bark alert. <laughs> so there's part one and this will be part two, but it, it might be a short part two because I think we're going to have a bark alert. Yeah. So, um, whoopsie, I'm going to stop recording. So thanks for, thanks for stopping by. I'll just pan out really quickly and show this. Now, Hopefully, I might not be. I might not need to go anywhere. <laughs> so that's how far we've got uh, with the hydras. Thank you for watching. <laughs>